Hey everybody, I don't look the greatest right now. My skin's breaking out. It just seems to do that. It's around that time of the month. And I've been cleaning, I swear, for like two weeks now. <laughs> so it's not been the funnest. I am going to give it a few minutes for, well, two secs. For anybody to show up that's going to for part one of the Angel Essence Aroma Haul. Boxes are tricky because I know I spent $134 on wax, wax only. And I only currently buy from, as everyone pretty much knows, um, Angel Essence Aroma, period. I do not buy from anybody else wax melts or pretty much any body care line. Um, I did already take the tape off the box. I have not opened it because um, address and stuff like that. But there's the Angel Essence Aroma sticker. And this is bigger than I normally get. Normally the boxes I get are like fairly small. I mean, I mean, and normally every time I order, I hate when it says very bad connection. It always seems to have a horrible connection in here. I don't get it for the life of me. But I guess I'm going to start. And if I find myself, or if you guys find me repeating myself, it's probably because somebody came on and asked questions. I wanted to go live with this for the people that have wanted to see and have been waiting for this unboxing like my followers from Instagram and other YouTubers. So, when I open the box, she's got it very protected because she does not want the products to be destroyed in the shipping. So, we're going to take all this and we're going to put it aside. There's not... This box, you guys, I'm not kidding you. There's like, I'm, you guys are seeing how much of this I'm pulling out. Like, my guess is, is she probably like super bubble wrapped because this is all that I've pulled out and it's right to wax. Literally. So, we are going to start with the first one. Throwing stuff everywhere. The first one. Mm, this box smells so freaking good. I always have to rip the tape like that. Mm. There's going to be like mounds of bubble wrap. Looks like there is two in this one. So wrap empty. And the first one is the Cotton Candy Vanilla Ice Cream. Kind of working with natural lighting. Sorry, it's probably destroying the quality. And my camera doesn't want to focus. Uh, decadent Vanilla and Cotton Candy Frosting Ice Cream with lots of gooey, creamy marshmallows. Such a mouth-watering scent. And it is. It smells really good. I've bought this one before. Mm. This was a repurchase. And this is her brittle. I'll try to find a good set. There's a big, big chunk in here. It's like, whoa. <laughs> and it's... Very pretty. And there's actually gems in some of them, but the gems are in like the smaller ones right now. And so that's number one. And the second one is Sugar Plum Cake Pops. This is going to take a little bit because we have a lot. And there's a second box that's coming as well that is part of this haul. Mm, so pretty. Mm. 
And this one, sweet sugar plum sprinkled with orange zest, vanilla, iced sugar cookie crumbles, and blended into a white, white cake pop. Mm. Now into the second. And some things are tricky to get into. Mm. Now some of these are old scents, some of them are new scents, and some of them are scents that I've never had before. So these two I've never had before. The first two I have had before and loved. This is Red Velvet Cake. Mm. <laughs> Ooh. Rich Velvety Cake. Tonka bean, creamy buttercream ice cr icing, sweet maraschino cherries with a thick cream cheese frosting. Yeah, yeah. I bet when you melt this, it's just going to explode with beautiful scents. And it's pretty. This one is a new one. This is vanilla sugar mimosa. Warm vanilla sugar drizzled over sweet strawberries, ripe raspberries, and sparkling pink Moscato mixed with fluffy buttercream. Ooh. I, I can smell it. I think that's the Moscato I'm smelling. Mmm. See how pretty it is? Love it. That one you can really smell the Moscato in it. Big time. Like they weren't playing. She did not play when she threw the Moscato up in there. Some more pretties. Mm. I hope all of you guys are having a good day. My little boy woke up this morning with a tummy ache. So, he didn't have a very good day. His belly was really bugging him most of the morning. But he's doing a little better now. I'm going to have to throw this. <laughs> I'm going to stick it in the chair next to me for now. Come on, move over today. I'm sorry, you guys. I'm, like, trying to find somewhere to stick the bowl of wrap, so... <coughs> And this is Beach Vibes. I like this one. This one is super yummy. Pink stands, bright citrus coconut, anise, jasmine, fresh air, spicy vanilla, orange push-up pops. Super bomb. Oh. Another beauty. This is the cream cheese strawberry mallow cookie. This is one of my faves. Mm, love it. Isn't it beautiful? And this is rich heaven with extra cream, creamy cream cheese frosting. Whoa, we got some fluffies. No pretties. I will also be posting tons and tons of photos of my order um, up on my Instagram, which is at vfinlay17. Well, v.finlay17. Okay, these are okay, these are both new. I'm super pumped for this one. This Wednesday brunch, me and her actually were having a conversation and we can concocted this one together. Um, she added stuff to it. I just wanted, pretty much was like, yeah, you should use that caramel kettle corn and something again because she made one called Autumn's Embrace that I just am in love with. Um, 
and the smell in that one, the key smell is the caramel kettle corn, and it is amazing. So, me and her concocted this one day having a discussion. And this is Wednesday brunch. Caramel kettle corn, granulated sugar, sweet vanilla, a hint of seasoning salt with fresh cheesecake and butter pecan sandies. Ooh. There's that kettle corn, baby. Love it. And it's pretty. Another beauty. I just love Angela and her waxes. Me and her are total BFFs. And I'm so thankful that I found her for a series of reasons. Because she's a really good friend of mine. And I love her to death. And she is such a positive person to have in my life. And she makes amazing sense. And I can talk to her. And she actually listens. This is a new one for me. This is one that she came up with. This is Pina Colada. Sweet melons, raspberry nectar, Italian lemon, light creamy coconut, raw sugar cane, and maraschino cherries. Mmm, that smells really good. It's got like a florally hint to it. Mmm, it's like it's pina colada, definitely, but it has like a floral note to it. I wonder if it's the raw sugar cane, maybe. I don't know what would be giving it that floral. I don't know, but it's pretty. Oh, there we go. We got a big old glob of pretties. <laughs> okay. Oh, silly stuff. I hope that you guys will all watch this later and leave comments. One of these is a new one, and one of them is a tried and true. The new one is Cherry Cake Wafers. I've heard so many raving things about this from other people in the group. Toasted almonds and cherry glaze with buttery vanilla wafer. Sounds bomb. Ooh, that is good. That is really good. You can find a nice sized piece. And it's pretty. It definitely rings cherry cola. Oh, I am so melting that one here soon. That one's so bomb smelling. And this is afternoon fix. I've had this before. This is a tried and true for this house. My little boy loves her cereal and cake scents. Mmm. This is Afternoon Fix, which is Rice Krispie Treats with loads of gooey marshmallow and a blend of crunchy cereals, fruity loops, and free pebbles. And it literally does smell like that. It's so yum. Mm. I can't wait to do the photos of these, all these. I'm one of the people, like, I love doing photos of her stuff. And, um... Because it's just beautiful on its own. But just to add simple, small stuff to it. Like, it, it, it's not even a joke. Like, you could have a full-on photo shoot with this stuff. Okay. <laughs> I love her. So sweet. Okay. Ugh. Now, I did kind of freak out with some of them. And, like, I think I doubled and tripled. Doubled or triple. Yeah, I doubled some. This is a double. Because <laughs> this one, like, full force up in this house. This is double order of Midnight Munchies. Mouth-watering fruity pebble cereal with vanilla, sugar, waffle cones, warm tea with cakes. My son loves this. Like I said, my kid in her cereal blends... He cannot get enough of them. And me. I love them. Who doesn't like to melt something, have their house smell like a childhood memory? For me, it's like, she's got like seven or eight cents that when I melt them in my house, it's like all these memories of my childhood. And um, when I was with my ex, who is, um, believe it or not, Still very important to me and in my life. Um, 
one, because we have kids together and because we just have a really good life. And there's some of her scents that actually put place really good memories of him in, um, in my head and in my heart brightens up my day sometimes. This is a new one and I'm super excited. This is the Peeps Marshmallow Cake. And it's a delicious blend of Peeps Marshmallow Cake with wild berry smoothie, marshmallow, and lots of vanilla ice cream. My kids are going to probably love this. And I got two bags of that. And this is a new one. I've never had it, but I'm pretty sure it's going to be the bomb. And it is. And I know y'all are thinking right now, like, there's no way that every single scent she makes is a hit for you. They are. Um, there's only one that I'm not super big on, and it's because I don't like uh, one of the florals that's in it. I, um, yeah, that was the only reason. I just didn't like one of the florals that was in it. So, and it wasn't actually, like, the scent itself I didn't like. Um, it gave me headaches. Weird enough, it gave me headaches. And I actually kind of liked the scent, but it gave me headaches, so I couldn't use it. This is beautiful. The Peeps Marshmallow Cake makes me think of a peep. Mm. Now I'm going to have a hard time figuring out what I'm going to melt. Or I'm going to be going out and buying some more, <laughs> some more warmers. I think that's what's going to end up happening. I'm going to be going getting some more warmers. Um, I did change my warmers. I changed three of my warmers out earlier. I still have four that I can fill and I will be and I'm probably just gonna end up going and buying some freaking other ones because that's how your girl do it mm. I'm so pumped like I can't even tell you guys I already just want to rip everything open and just start melting right now like this is my addiction like yeah I'm into beauty I'm into makeup I really am into skincare and stuff like that my addiction is Angela's wax like, I will pick to <laughs> spend money on her wax and her lotions and stuff than a brand new palette that just dropped. Yeah. So. I'm bad about that. You guys probably hear a fence. It's because my big dog's in the backyard and she doesn't like the hummingbirds. And I put up the feeders because they start popping their little heads around and I always have hummingbird feeders up in the springtime so I have I think like specific birds that just continuously come back here because they know that I'm gonna have the feeders out for them and the other day one of them popped their cute little head and was like hey I'm here and so that night I went out and I bought four new feeders and I put one of them up in the back and I have three more set up and I got the food all made so I'm gonna be putting those up later on tonight when my hubby gets home. Okay, this one is a new one, and this one sounds amazing because I love lemon. I love the smell of lemon. I love the way lemon tastes. Uh, kind of like cotton candy for me. Like, those are two big dire things for me. And so this one is the Lemon Marshmallow Sugar Cookie, and it says freshly baked lemon marshmallow sugar cookies with butter and sweet vanilla. It sounds simple, but really pretty. Something is irritating my eye. I might have got a little wax in it. <laughs> My hand smell. And I've been handling all the wax. Ooh. Yum. Super yum. That's very good. That smells really good. <laughs> See? That's, oh. It reminds me of the smell of like really good lemon pound cake like the bomb.com lemon pound cake now i was kind of confused with this on if this was the same berry buttered hot cakes that i had gotten before which was blueberry or not so i'll know by the way i smell when i smell this if it's the same thing or not but this is also called berry buttered hot cakes and it says honey buttered rolls churned whipped Butter, buttery pancakes topped with mixed berries and maple syrup. It sounds very similar in the description. I don't know by the smell. 
I have a little hummingbird in my window right now. And he's so cute. This smells a little different. Not a lot, but a little bit. There's something different in this one. He's so cute. I'm so in love with my hummingbirds, you guys. It's so crazy. I wonder if I can flip this. So y'all can see him. See him? Oh, he's gone. Darn it. He's there for a minute. Did you see that? I love him. Love my hummingbirds. Okay. We're down. Okay, and we're down to the last three bindles in this box. Yep, making sure. Now all these fluffies can go back in there for the photos. While I'm doing this. So if you want to save some money, go to Angel Essence Aroma, place your order, and type in Veronica 10 and save 10% off your entire order at Angel Essence Aroma. My son's here with me. What, honey? Okay, let mommy finish your video. And then I will make you something to eat. Just only have three bags. It's not a huge weight. This is another double. Because I love the lemon. Dreamy puffs. Dreamy puffs. Mmm. Oh yeah, it smells the same. Just it needs to cure a little longer. Okay, this is a decadent blend of lemon verbena, fresh, fresh baked almond macaroon, and luscious pink sugar, and it smells really, really good. These don't have any sparkly on them, but they're shaped cute and pretty. Mm -hmm. And that's what these are two of the same. I think this is another two of the same. It is this is sugar addict and I got two of them. My husband loves this one. Fresh baked banana nut bread with a side of sweet vanilla chai tea topped with marshmallows. This stuff smells super good. It's really pretty. I'm trying to hurry up. Sorry, you guys. It's 23 minute long unboxing. Okay. Last two for this box. I have another box still coming. This is Nana Norma Zucchini Bread, a classic sweet bread, honey cream, brown sugar, cinnamon sugar, and nutmeg, which are blended with garden fresh zucchini and crafted to yummy home good treats. Mmm. Smells super good. And Angel Kisses. This one's really good too. Fresh banana, sweet grapefruit, a mandarin, orange, kiwi, coconut cream, raspberries, bubblegum, strawberry, and a touch of apple. I remember this one, you really smell the banana in, and the apple and bubblegum and stuff start coming through um, when it melts. Another beautiful one. And that concludes the very first unboxing which has left me with a huge pile of wax. Yeah. Crazy, huh? And there is another box coming with even more. Let's see. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. So about nine, eight more things, eight more different waxes coming. <laughs> and one of them is a super big clamshell. 
Like, it's like this, but it is ginormous. And she offers those on her store as well. You can also find her on Instagram at Angel Essence Aroma. And that's it, you guys. This is part one. And I'm so excited that I got to share this with you. Please <laughs> leave a comment. Subscribe if you're not already subscribed. And share this video. Like it as well. Thumbs up. Have a nice day.